Dunkinator Music. What's up, Gems? It's your girl, Chucky, and I'm back with another one. So I always tell y'all, we come on here any kind of way. So I'm a, I'm a live to that. I'm gonna be true to that, and I'm gonna come on here when I look a hot mess. We gonna get into this later. Um, I sound a mess. First of all, I want to cut my head out because it look I don't even know where to begin. Let me just say. I can't even get my cough out all the way like I want to because my body hurts so bad. So, um, Friday, no, Thursday. So, I'm trying to, I'm trying to remember if it was Thursday or Wednesday. I'm trying to figure out where the cough came from and when it happened. So Thursday, I feel like I was, you know, smoking, doing me on my lunch break. And I I choked, you know, um, bad. Like my throat was hurting. And so Friday, I went to work felt like no Thursday night okay so Thursday night I went to school and I was cool the whole day like my throat was irritated but I was cool you know then um um after lunch I felt like shit like my body was hurting like when i say my body was hurting y'all couldn't even walk i went home and i got right up under bed i was like i'm freezing i'm cold and babe was like you're hot you're hot and i had put my feet on her and she was like whoa hold up your feet are cold like my body was hot but my feet were cold but i was freezing y'all i was shivering so i'm trying to think if the irritation was in my throat on wednesday and not thursday because i feel like it was thursday and it wasn't from the choke but I didn't really too much pay attention to the irritation until Thursday. But I also feel like my classmate got me sick. I feel like Ariel got me sick because that heifer was coughing for three days. And I tried my best to, y'all, I tried my best to stay away from her. Like, we all did, like washing our hands hand sanitizer like she was washing her hands and stuff and we weren't working on each other we were only working on ourselves but i still feel like being with only three other people besides myself in that room i think she got me sick um so where we at fast forward to friday night um I was cool all day Friday. It was just like a little cough or whatever. Friday night, my throat, y'all, when I say my throat was on fire, we had took my mother-in-law to Sam's. Y'all, my throat was on fire. If I still have the footage, I was vlogging the other day, but I'm not used to vlogging um, like that. So it I, I suck at vlogging. Um, so I'm gonna see if I have any footage of how I was sounding in the cough and stuff like that. But um, if you don't see it, then I don't. Um, but yeah, so Friday night, my throat was on fire. Um, I was taking lodges and um, cough drops and stuff. Saturday, I went to a um, 
education meeting and I just had a small cough, no throat irritation, nothing like that. Um, what else? Like, I just had a cough all day Saturday. Today, y'all, my stomach and my back muscles hurt so bad from coughing in my sleep. Like, oh my God, y'all, when I tell you, I'm in so much pain. My throat hurt. I've been doped up on medicine been sleeping all day and y'all want to know the worst part about all of this y'all my fiance is sick Duncan is oh my god baby so y'all look at her in this goddamn Mommy. look at her in this goddamn onesie she look like shit <laughs> be sick hmm? be sick oh. so you don't have to be quarantined to the um to the room because we can't um we can't afford for you to be sick <coughs> especially in the house so um you can't touch anything in our room at all. Okay? Uh, I'll figure something out. But yeah, you're going to have to keep your distance. Because I cannot afford to, for you to get sick. <coughs> Alright, gents, I'm back. Looking worse than I did earlier. Um, like I told y'all, babysit too. So I just, um, um, I just gave her some meds. Um, I took one pill, but I'm gonna dope myself up when I'm done editing. <coughs> um, I'm done making sure she's okay before I can really go to sleep. Um, and get kind of bed. <coughs> and ready for the school week. <coughs> um, I'm gonna probably um, uh, Lysol and bleach the bathroom down <coughs> and the doorknobs and stuff because we make uh, Kai use our bathroom and then the kitchen too because I've been in the kitchen all day today. Ooh, excuse me. And I need to put dinner on for tomorrow, so I'm a um. Okay, well you need to eat. <laughs> um. Ah, uh, they got tricked. Why don't we try focusing on the positive? They're together. So it is currently 7.37 p.m. Sunday. Baby. Baby. Eat. Can you at least drink some broth? Put some on your stomach, please. Yes. 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 I don't care. Come on. Give me a couple of bites, please. No, you didn't. I want to see at least three bites. Okay, well then, you better eat with your eyes closed. I need three bites. At least. You play too much. Great news for the lactose intolerant demons. Nothing in here on the demon kids who escaped, though we hope escape. But there's a whole page dedicated to the ice cream man. What? He is mortal. What? Do you remember when demons look like demons and innocents look like innocents? Wait, well, who changed the rules on us? Great, if he's mortal, how does he do it? It's not him. Bingo, it's a song. It says the ice cream which is a series of notes that have been sounding together yeah. specifically to kids like moths to a plane. Could have been. Can I eat it? Inside the truck, mm -hmm. That's why he pulls them in there. All right, y'all. I'm going to um, 
check back in with y'all later. I'm gonna probably either eat these pickles and some orange juice and edit and watch TV. Get the kid to bed, like I said. Make sure she dope. And then I'm gonna dope myself up and I'll see y'all when I wake up. Bye, y'all. It went down. It was 103.8 about an hour ago. I gave her meds. And her fever is already going down. Bring it up. So she should she shouldn't have a fever by in the morning, but we are going to urgent care to kick the cough. Um this little course that she's going through, it's going to wear off when she sweats it out so i'm gonna make sure it's hot as fuck in here mm -mm. we're gonna die but yeah she not with it but somebody gotta take care of her so should be all right all right y'all i'll be back with the next update all right y'all so i told y'all i was gonna come back with an update Um, for the most part, it's just like body pain for me and being uncomfortable. <coughs> <coughs> it's currently 3.30 in the morning. I burn my damn chili beans. I was up watching TV. I had put water over them for a second time. Bruh, she about to kill me. It's fucking hot. Um, she got a fever of 102. She says she cold, but her body is hot. Um, I'm hot right now, and it was hot earlier, and it's hot right now. Then, so I'm back with an update. Um, we took babe's fever again like this morning when we had got up, and it was 102 point something. I don't remember. Um, so her fever hasn't broke yet. So I told y'all, I can't remember if I told y'all I was coming to the urgent care or not, but we're here and. It's not packed, but everybody got on mask. Like, I knew something didn't feel right. I'll just talk to you guys in a minute. So she took all my vitals. Um, and they're going to either get babe in a room or put her in here with me so that we could get checked out together. Um, I'm pretty sure they're going to do like the flu swab or whatever. Um, I don't know. I think I kind of like let mine pass through for the most part and I kept just going forward and moving with my life as if I wasn't sick so 
I don't know, but babes is a little more heavier. I really, honestly, I came for her and not myself. That's the crazy part. <coughs> but I'm um I'm still having like body pain or whatever, and my hair still ain't washed. It is so dirty. Like, y'all don't understand how dirty it is. And then on top of that, like, I've been sweating all night. Yeah, watch this. Marco. <laughs> we play Marco Polo around these pods. Hi, babies. Hi. Are you done over there? Hell no, I'm, I fell asleep in there. Mm -hmm. So the nurse just came in. Uh, pretty much my fever is still high so 102.6 they want to back up mm -hmm. <coughs> yeah they ain't even claiming it for me yet because I don't even have a fever she's going to give me some Tylenol to try to break it I, I told her the last time I took medicine was around 4 or so yeah so they're going to give me some Tylenol check for strep and flu and then come back with the results and go from there. Damn, them bitches didn't even come in there yet. Yeah. Oh, I gotta go. Sorry, Hi. my fiance is in there. Are you sure? Yes, Are you that's sure? me. I'm Mark. I'm one of the FDAs here. So I heard you're not feeling well for almost a week. Is that right? <laughs> yes. There it is. Cough, congestion, yes. headache, chills. Oh Any my fever goodness. with it that you know of? Um. Okay. So Friday, um, we didn't take it, but. Yeah. I was like the chills, but okay. my body was hot, um, and we couldn't find a the thermometer to take okay. it. But by Saturday morning, the fever had broke. It okay. was just like the body pains, gotcha. the chills, okay. cough. Coughing up a lot. Yeah. Okay, and then no chance of pregnancy right now? No. Okay, and you're not allergic to any Not that I okay. know of. Let's start by looking at the ears and we'll just work our way down then. Okay. All right. Let's start by giving a look here. That looks good. Thank you. Perfect. Okay, the ears look good. Can I take a look at your throat? Ooh. You don't mind. That's what. Pretty that sore? That was the main. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Is it still pretty sore? Or yeah. Is it, okay. And Saturday, I was supposed to come. I was supposed to come Friday night because it got to the point to where it was burning. Okay. I don't know if it was from the coughing so right. much, but. Or just direct irritation. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. It was bad. Real deep. Good. Sounds good. Just normal now. Okay. Repeat. All right. Last one. Good. Okay. That's good. Are you okay back here? <coughs> yeah. Okay. So let's go ahead and we're going to swab you for strep. And then you're beyond the, the uh, time when we can treat you for the flu, but do you want to know for contact reasons if you have the flu? Um. Well, my fiance, they said that they're testing her okay. for it. For, okay. I don't know if I passed it to her. Okay. Um, do you want to check and see then, or do you just want to? Because I can't do anything for you for the flu, but for... It's, to be honest, it's mainly my throat okay. and my cough. So, um, uh, I have a little bit of body ache, but yeah. I've taken BC powder. Okay. Um, I have... Um, what an elderberry okay. dissolvable pills, but it's soothing it for like an hour or so. Okay. It's mainly the cough in my throat. throat. Okay, well, wait here. We're going to swab your throat and I'll be back in. Okay, okay thank you. Sure. <coughs> um, he said that I'm too late for the flu, so he's going to test me for strep. Um, just because of my symptoms and stuff. So, um, I'll let you know when he comes back. Okay.
Bro, I need to take my glasses and get them to just tighten. Y'all see, I didn't do nothing but step up on this goddamn bed. And my glasses fly off. They just... I think it's because I'm so hard on my glasses. Like, I fall asleep in my glasses. Baby, I have to take them off. I'm about to change this channel. I like cartoons. I'm a cartoon bitch. Don't nobody care about this shit. Ooh, I can watch Puppy Dog Pals or Paw Patrol. Chicago PD. Grey's Anatomy. My A. strip yeah i hope i don't have strip because i'm gonna be pissed off <clears throat> so i'm cold y'all tried to self-medicate for as long as i could <clears throat> i just couldn't do it no more Cause my throat hurts so bad. So I don't have throat. I mean, I don't have throat. I don't have strep. <clears throat> um, but they're gonna give me a Z pack, give me some numbing medicine, um, and. Uh, <sighs> Some other stuff. I have to take Tylenol. I have to take Mucinex. Um, bunch of other stuff to kind of break it up. And he said I'm going to be off work for the next three days. <coughs> but I can't afford to miss school. Like... Three days of school is me failing a course and I don't have thousands of dollars to repay for a course. So I'm about to be, I'm probably gonna miss. No, I, I don't think I can miss today or tomorrow. I don't know. I really can't afford to miss school. Like, <sighs> I don't see this pimple on my forehead. That's that's what sucks. <coughs> okay, so first of all, this commercial I just see. You know you're not supposed to put soap and stuff in your vagina. And Vagisil and stuff throws off your pH balance. Like the little body wash care stuff, all with all them scents and stuff. That throws off your pH balance. Your vagina needs hot water, a little bit of non-bacterial, non-scented soap. And Vagisil done came out with some, some fresh air some air freshener for the coochie. Um, why would you need to spray your cooch with air freshener? First of all, it's supposed to have its own natural smell. It ain't gonna smell like bubble gum, flowers, and roses, and flowers, roses are flowers, but, you know, fruits, vegetables, whatever you want, whatever you wanna name, your vagina is not gonna smell like that. It's gonna have its own smell. It might be musky, like a sweating vagina would smell like. Um, <clears throat> but you're not gonna have like this smell good smell and putting all that stuff on your vagina trying to get her to smell good. It's gonna have you itching, burning, and irritated, and all that extra shit. So y'all gotta be careful with these companies and buying their products for them to even think that they have room to create something else, like an air freshener for the coochie. Like if you feel like you gotta spray air freshener on your coochie, baby, you just need to go get some soap and water and wash that little pretty thing and um change your drawers, like. You shouldn't have to spray your drawers for it to smell good. 
Like, I mean, I can understand if you spray perfume, like, on your clothes, you know, behind the ears, on the neck, you know, especially, like, right here, because that's where it's, like, I don't know, I don't know what the whole science thing is, but, you know, it kind of attracts, whatever. Anyways, that's besides the point, but why would you want to spray something like that on your vagina, though? Like, it's a self-cleaning organ. It cleans itself, so you don't need to be up in there doing all extra. Y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all. Let me tell y'all what Kai did. So he gonna get me for telling this story, but I find it so funny and so cute. Um, kinda in a non like perverted way because he's just funny. Okay, so listen, just. So, um, we were watching a movie together one day, and, um, and, um, uh, the little boy had sprayed, um, some cologne in his drawers or whatever, and I was just like, mm, I hope he didn't, you know, get it all on his thing or whatever, and Kai, <laughs> Kai was like, um, yeah, because I did that before with soap. He said, he said, mom, my, my, my ball. He said, mom, it was burning. He, he said, mom, it was burning. And then when I went to the. I said I would keep y'all updated through this process. Um, so, uh, I can't remember the last thing I told you guys. But I'm getting treated for uh, bronchitis. Uh, my flu, my my strep swab was negative, but Babe's flu swab was positive, which is crazy. Like, um, I need to pick up. I need to pick up for, uh, but it was just sent over from Warren or uh, Urgent Care. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> Sherry. <coughs> okay. H-I-N-E-S Okay Yes It'll be the same as Robinson It'll be under my name uh, And uh, what was What was the generic Huh Tamba flu If this was too expensive She uh, they said ask for a Tamba flu. Ask for a Tamba flu. She said. She said if you call, the doctor said if you call, they, they'll approve it. If that's too expensive for her, we'll need to know. Yeah. Damn, I forgot about y'all. I was just over here. Ugh, I need to clean my she ears she out. She said, she said, this is too expensive. I didn't get this. Because you automatically got the flu. I technically... And probably in the end stages of my flu, which is why he's he's treating me for bronchitis. Why are you? Yo, I lost my blunt on the way to the doctor, bro. Like I feel like. No. I 
I feel it's because from what I've read, it makes it makes your insurance go up and stuff. Like they treat you differently when you have it. Y'all, my hair been crusty. Listen, I was scratching this side. Like this side is so sore. But it like when I got up this morning to put it in a ponytail to uh, go to the doctor. Oh my God. Like I'm going to have to wash my hair. It looks so disgusting and nasty. Like it looked like I had braids in for months. Okay. Y'all remember that time? Oh my God. Did y'all see that video? where I had took my braids down cause I left them in for three months and babe and Lachelle was talking about me. That's what my hair look like right now. It was, it's disgusting. Like, I don't even know if y'all can see, look at that. And it's dandruff. Like, I don't understand why my scalp is like that. But then again, I do because our room that motherfucker stay hot. She got a whole week off. Y'all only got three days. Yeah, I didn't want to hold you. I thought she was going to be a few days. She was like, no, the minimum is five. I thought you were. I thought you were. Bitch, I've been down for two. What, you, what more you want from me? Did it say you can go back early? Oh. Nope. Mine says I can go back early. Um, I look raggedy as fuck. How I've been looking for the last 24 hours. Two days, I guess I should say. Two days. I've been looking like this for two days, y'all. Three days. Four days. No, Saturday I looked okay. I've been like looking like this for three days. Three days. I'm about to go ahead and pick up our meds. Uh, I need to brush my tongue. Bitch. I'll get the raw and unmotherfucking cut, okay? I might cut that out because it did look a little disgusting, but y'all still get the raw and uncut. Like, I'm just not about doing my hair and putting on clothes just to come on here and tell y'all hi and talk to y'all. Like, I'm y'all friend. Like, y'all gonna see me how my friends see me. Busted, crusted, and can't be motherfucking trusted. You know? Ew. <laughs> Ew, y'all look. I told y'all my hair was dirty. Okay. I'm not sure if they called the one for Heinz back yet. Oh, yes, they did. Y'all, I hate getting this lady. This lady be pissing me off. I'm supposed to be getting some Mucinex, but I got some cough syrup at home. Like $60? Damn. And she only got one prescription. I got four. Hey. Ma'am, you're expensive. And then she double. Can you give me some clam chowder? Girl, you don't leave me alone. She might be hungry later, so I might have to. Okay, thank you. You do the same. Y'all, anything for my baby girl? Y'all know I ride for my babies. All four of them, the raunchy ass, motherfucking badass dogs, too. Y'all, my dogs. So, 
y'all know I was sick all day Sunday, right? So, Babe was sick all day Sunday, but Babe wasn't at home. Kai and Babe wasn't home. So, I had called to check on Babe, and she's like, I'm ready to come home. I don't feel good. Like, all I've taken was just this one medicine, and I can't do it. And so, I go to, um... I go to pick her up or whatever and we come home and we ride down the street and you hear Kylie say Zena and I look and I see Zeus Zeus done found a way he okay so first of all they redid our whole gate except for the gate door which didn't make sense so Zeus is able to first of all put his head like almost under the gate, but not completely. So he done found a way to um, get loose. First of all, he chewed up the board. He chewed the bottom of the board and he done, he made himself fit through where the board was chewed up and pulled the board off the gate so now we got a hole in our gate that needs to be fixed which we have wood at the house that they left um um that they were supposed to come get so i'm gonna have to go to home depot sometime tomorrow or the day after or something and um um get some get the right nails that I need so that I can put the boards back on the gate because the gate needs to be fixed but we got to be at home in our gate cuz cuz of Zeus and Zena and they asses got out so I don't know how long they was out but when we came home they were still on our block but we done already got the police called on us once and I don't have time for it again because if they call the police or the dog pound this time, like I'm not coming I'm not gonna go get their ass. Yo, I don't think y'all understand how hard it is being a dog parent. Having pets, having dogs alone is just not the business. But I'm about to get in here. I'm about to take a nap before the kid comes home because I'm going to have to cook and I'm going to have to quarantine myself <laughs> to my room. My kid ain't going to like it, but oh well. I don't know why I told y'all I found some flower seeds. And I was really over there talking to y'all. Like, y'all see what the fuck I had going on. Like a damn duck. Who does that? Me. Me, that's who. Me. Me, that's who. About to take these ponytails out my head. I'm about to get in my bed. I'm about to take a nap. Like I told y'all. <sighs> I mean, technically, I'm not talking to myself, but I'm talking to myself. Is that mine? Because mine was in the bed. Is what? That mask. No. Okay. So, y'all know, I told y'all, I feel sick, yo. I feel like I got to throw up. Well, I don't know if I tried to tell y'all or not. I can't remember, but... Um... I have class today. And I just came up here to bring my doctor's note. And I didn't even get down the hallway good. And my teacher was like, uh, you got a doctor's note? And I was like, yeah. And she was like, okay, bye. She had <laughs> she had um somebody come to the door to get the doctor's note so I wouldn't walk in the classroom. <coughs> so I'm about to go um get some canned beans for home.
homemade chili because I don't remember if I told y'all or not, but I um I uh put some some a pot of beans on last night for chili. Like y'all, I've been sitting and waiting on me to get the rest of the ingredients I needed for my chili beans. And I just knew this little chili bean mix was gonna be bomb. Y'all, I fell asleep after I took some cough medicine and burned my damn beans. Burn my goddamn beans. I was so mad. Like, it pisses me off. Like, beans, like, making beans from, like, scratch is, like, my kryptonite. Rice and bacon. Beans, rice, and bacon, that's my kryptonite. Don't ask me to make, you know, white rice unless it's instant and I can cook it within 10, 15 minutes. Don't ask me to cook, you know, bacon because I'm going to look at it and I'm like, okay, it needs just a couple of more minutes and I'm going to forget about it and burn it. Never fails every time. Um, so I'm about to go to the store and get some cheese and get... <coughs> some um beans, like I said. <clears throat> I've been sleep. I took a good ass nap too. So, 